So, I don't normally make videos like this, but this is a video that I just wanted to share my opinion on. Now, before I get into anything, I really hope the YouTuber I'm going to talk about, which is Griffin Gaming, I'm going to do everything in my power to make sure he sees this video. I side with Hippozone 100%. Griffin Gaming needs to stop. He's an idiot. He's an idiot. I, I side with Hippozone 100%. So before we even get into this video, man, I just need to ask you guys a favor here. Can you go ahead and hit the like button? Because in all honesty, I just have a feeling a massive wave of hate is just going to flood my entire YouTube channel after the truth is out here that Hippozone was the one who was right this entire time. It turns out that in this entire situation where me and Hippo were beefing, you know, I thought that Hippo was the big brained individual, but after watching this video, I have come to realize that this entire time, it was really me who was a very low IQ person. So guys, if you can somehow find it in your hearts to forgive me, please hit that like button. I am begging you. I need all the support I can get because this video, I really, and I don't mean this unironically, I do not think my channel can survive this, but you know what? We have to cover this, man. No hiding from the truth. It needs to be out there. And well, regardless of the fact that it's me this time, my job is to make fun of dumb people on the internet. And I have an obligation to you guys to bring you some quality ass content, regardless of who we talk about and it just turned out this time that the person we are going to be roasting is myself so without further ado guys let's go ahead and check out this absolute masterpiece of a youtube video so i don't normally make videos like this but this is a video that i just wanted to share my opinion on now before i get into anything i really hope the youtuber i'm going to talk about which is griffin gaming i'm going to do everything in my power to make sure he sees this video I really want him to see this video. I feel like I should be thanking this man because not only did he open my eyes to the truth about this entire situation surrounding me and Hippo, but it's drier than a motherfucker out here right now in terms of content on YouTube to talk about. So I guess I should really be thanking him for doing everything in his power to make sure I saw this video. So big ups to this guy and thank you in advance for all that sweet, sweet ad revenue I'm gonna make from this video. Because it's important of what I'm about to say. Now, I'm gonna just guess. I'm gonna get into it now. Thank God, the suspense is killing me. So basically, Griffin Gaming is a YouTuber with about 160,000 subscribers on YouTube, and he makes really dumb videos, like bashing people and stuff like that. And he he just does videos about making fun of people. Like, there's a little bit of a caveat there. Yeah, I like to make fun of people. I like to laugh at dumb shit I find online, but that's exactly what it is. It's dumb shit, you know? It has to be, like, extremely cringe, extremely disingenuous, or just plain stupid. Like, that's typically what I focus on. I don't just open up YouTube, find a video, and it's like, yeah, I want to ruin this man's entire career today. That's not exactly how it works, but I will concede one thing, okay? My content is not the most highly produced. It's not the most well thought out. I'm here to entertain and have fun. Like, in all honesty, it's not that deep, bro, but, you know, I will say my content is a little bit on the dumb side i will admit it i will accept that roast from you dude i could definitely do better if i wanted to but you know i'm just having fun with this shit at this point my goal in life is not exactly to be a professional youtuber now he's made multiple videos on another youtuber called um hippozone now at one point i think hippozone had like two two thousand subscribers on youtube but his channel got terminated or I don't exactly know what happened. Well, allow me to fill you in, my dude. He's deleted his channel, like, four or five times at this point. I mean, it's hard for me to even keep up with this shit at this point. But yeah, never terminated. He deleted his own channel, 100% his choice. Now, he did get banned off Mixer for whipping his dick out on stream and pissing in a bottle. But you know, that's another topic. He never did something like that on YouTube, to my knowledge. So, he was never terminated. He's deleted his own channel. And honestly, I can't even keep up with the amount of times he's deleted his own channel at this point. So, I really don't blame anyone who's not exactly caught up. But now you know. Now you have the full picture here. At one point he had 2,000. Right now he is about over 350. Last time I checked. So he's made multiple videos on Hippozone, um, making fun of him and calling him an idiot and stuff like that. Because in one um, live stream a year ago, Hippozone made. He said he was unemployed and he was living with his mom. 
I mean, that's not even close to why I started making videos on it, but you know what? We'll just go with it, man. Apparently, in a live stream, he said that he was unemployed and living with his mom. So all of a sudden, you know, I just discovered this small channel out of nowhere and decided, you know what? I'm gonna make videos on this guy because why not, man? Like, you really just cannot argue against this reasoning. He has me completely figured out at this point, guys. Now, that, that seems to be one of the only insults Griffin and his fans can say that but they can't think of anything else, and I'm not even exaggerating by that. It's been over a year, and they still use the same thing. When, first of all, he's not even 30 years old, he is... 28 years old. I mean, I don't really see how that's relevant. I mean, I just use the clip because it's funny, dude. Like, it's a funny clip. I don't really take it seriously. I don't really care. Like, honestly, it means nothing to me. I just think it's funny, but apparently this is a big deal. You know, Hippozone's age is the smoking gun here. You know, Griffin Gaming exposed. He's actually 28 years old, not 30 years old. Therefore, your entire points in every single video you make about this man completely invalid. Like I said, guys, this video is not going to play well for me. My channel is probably not going to survive this shit. So, you know, I feel like I need to shill for likes again. So please, if you could find it in your heart to somehow forgive me after this absolute disaster of a video for me, please hit that like button, guys. I'm literally on my hands and knees begging at this point. But yeah, apparently Hippo is 28 years old, which, you know, just makes him look like even more of a liar in all honesty. So in defending Hippo on this point, you've kind of exposed him for being a liar. But you know what? We're not going to get into that shit here. He said that in a recent video. I can even put... Put the clip right here now. So you just watched that. We did? Did I fucking miss something here? Yo, I can even put put the clip right here now. So you just watched that. This man is gonna single-handedly destroy my entire YouTube career. And that proves that Hippozone... Cause he's... What, Cause why would he lie? There's no point in lying. And he said he's certified in IT. So, which, which means he's working IT. So, I don't know what the point is of keep making videos about him if he's actually trying to do something with his life. In case you haven't noticed, the majority of videos on my channel talking about Hippo Zone have been response videos. Keyword there on response videos, and in order to make a response video, someone has to make a video talking about you, or have like a live stream clip in which they're trying to shit talk you for me to respond to. That's how it works. So I find it very interesting that you're trying to argue that he has moved on from the situation, when by definition, I cannot make a response video to someone unless they put out a video first for me to respond to. So I'm not really sure you understand how it works in this entire situation, but you know, maybe I'm just wrong here. I mean, after all, I only made the YouTube videos. Now, at the beginning, I didn't really, I'm gonna be honest, I did not like Hippozone because he just seemed like an idiot. But after watching his YouTube videos and live streams, I now actually side with Hippozone because Griffin Gaming is an idiot. Damn, bro. These roasts. These roasts are just next level, man. I'm not fit for YouTube anymore. I cannot handle this type of heat, but I find it kind of funny that, you know, he decided he was going to side with Hippozone after watching his videos and his live streams, because typically that has the complete opposite effect. You know, most people, when they start to realize the type of man we're dealing with here, you know, it kind of starts to drive them away, but I guess everyone is entitled to their opinion, you know? This entire situation, like I said, does not look good for me, and my guess is this man saw something that no one else could when it came to the beef, but between me and Hippo Zoned. He makes the same video over and over again. And he even said this. I'll, I will try and find the clip and put it in here. He said this in a video saying, it's just a dead topic at this point. I'm gonna, I'm just doing it for the YouTube ad revenue. That's not exactly what he said probably, but he said something similar to that and I will put it right. I will find the clip and put it in this video right now right now. But I expected more than some obviously fake text messages at this point, dude. You know, when you swing at me, I expect a little bit more. I expect to at least be entertained. But that video was so disappointing, man. I couldn't even milk it for 10 minutes in order to get some easy ad revenue because in all honesty, that's about all you're good for at this point. So you just saw that. 
Well, I mean, at least that clip showed up this time, but I don't really get what the point is here. Like, that was obvious shit talk in a YouTube video. What did you expect? Did you expect me to thank Hippozone to the video to allow me to respond to false allegations that I was apparently texting him and his aunt in the DMs, bro? Like, apparently that's how I want to spend my time. It's obvious that drama sells on YouTube, and that's why I was making the video, so that's why I was simply stating that his one-minute video accusing me of doing this didn't really give me a lot to work with because it was so ridiculous and just so obviously fake. So I was saying it was a shame that I couldn't stretch the video out to 10 minutes to get even more ad revenue from it because that was literally the only reason worth responding to that video for. And basically, he's just doing it to milk views it. Literally, the only reason he's still doing it is because either number one, he's bored, he doesn't know what video to make, or he just wants a bunch of views. Because the Hippo Zone videos do really well because people find enjoyment out of it. He literally just does it for views at this point. I mean, who would have guessed that people upload YouTube videos publicly to the internet to get views? I guess what they say really is true. You really do learn something new every single day. Now, another thing I also want to say is, um... Hippozoned left YouTube for about a year. He came back recently about a few months ago. But during that time he was gone, uh, Griffin was still making videos about uh, Hippozone even while he was gone. Hippozone decided to take some time off to focus on his life and do whatever he wanted to do. But during that time, he was still making videos about him and just doing everything he could to get views. I know, God forgive me for my sins, you know, uploading YouTube videos to get views. I mean, how could anyone forgive me at this point? This is what I mean, guys. Like, some of the stuff I've done is indefensible. Like, uploading a YouTube video for the sole purpose of entertaining people and getting views? Jesus Christ, man, how the fuck can you defend that? Now, that's just really stupid. Someone left to, to do what they wanted, even when everyone wanted him to leave. Let me get that clear. Everyone wanted him to leave YouTube because everyone hates him for some reason. Like, literally everyone hates Hippozone. That is 100% false. I have never wanted Hippozone to leave YouTube. I personally love his content. I love watching his live streams. They're some of the most entertaining streams on this entire platform. So I genuinely feel like YouTube is a better place with him on it because he's given me tons of content in the past. It's fun to watch him rage on his streams. And overall, I feel like the internet is a better place with him on it. So I personally never wanted him to leave and I definitely don't hate the man. Like, here's a secret. I don't really hate anyone that I talk about in YouTube videos because I don't really take this internet shit too too seriously. Even you making this video, like, trying to shit talk me or whatever you want to call it, I don't really care, dude. I have nothing against you. I don't take this shit personally. I find it fun. Like, this is my entertainment. I do YouTube because it's fun. I'm not planning on making this my career. I literally have, like, an internship this summer to get me ready to find a real job once I graduate from grad school, so I don't really care at the end of the day. This is not my life. I don't take it super serious, and I really wish more people would share that mentality because at the end of the day, this internet shit really doesn't mean all that much. Life is literally too short to be genuinely pissed off over people on the internet. If you look at all his videos, they have more dislikes than likes. Like, and even, I just think it's stupid at this point, like, Griffin Gaming needs to stop this, which is why I really want him to see this video. I mean, I saw the video, but I think the result is the complete opposite of what you intended. I side with Hippozoned 100%. And I would try to get in touch with Hippozone as well, so he can see this and just know that at least someone is on his side and that he's not by himself because, you know, oh, and another thing, another thing. Oh my god, guys, we're not even done yet. The plot continues to thicken. He, about a year ago, I, th I think this was about a year ago as well, he broke his monitor on stream. Nah, that was like a month or two ago, bro, but nice try. Because... I don't- I don't exactly know the reason why, but everyone making fun of him for breaking his monitor on stream, when that was over a year ago, you gotta understand, people get angry sometimes, and they just... do things that aren't right. But he broke his monitor because he was angry, he said he was angry at... people... He's tired of people making videos about him and stuff like that. So you gotta understand, 
you would probably not be happy if someone kept making videos about you over and over and over again making fun of you and just being really annoying. Actually, I would because I can milk that shit for content, kind of like I'm doing right now, but that's not the reason why he punched his monitor. It's because he rage quit from a Call of Duty match, which I really wouldn't consider that a natural response to, you know, rage quitting from Call of Duty, but you know what? I guess shit happens, right? Just being like a thorn in their side. And that's basically all I want to talk about in this video. I side with Hippo Zone 100%. Griffin Gaming needs to stop. He's an idiot. I may have another follow-up follow video about Griffin as well. A completely different topic. I am eagerly awaiting for that video to come out. Please do not bitch out like Breakthrough did and actually release the part two, dude. Like, I have my literal fingers crossed at this point because I want to see this shit so badly. Like, please give me content. It is so dry out here right now. So, just want to throw that out there. And I think I am done. Just to recap, Griffin Gaming is an idiot. He needs to stop uh, messing with Hippozone. Hippozone is right. Just like I am. I'm never wrong. And yeah, that's all I want to say. Well, you heard the man. He is never wrong, so I guess I'm wrong in the situation. But anyway, guys, you can be the judge. You know, if you want to stick with me, I just could not thank you enough. But I completely understand those who feel the need to unsubscribe right now and never watch another one of my YouTube videos again. Because in all honesty, I don't even think I can forgive myself after watching this entire seven-minute video just completely destroying me. But anyway, guys, if by some chance you did enjoy this video, like I mentioned at the beginning of this video, I need your support. Please drop a like on it. I would greatly appreciate it. It would mean the absolute world to me. But with that said, guys, that is going to do it for this video today. I do want to thank you all so much for taking the time out of your day to check out this video and for all the recent support as well. And I will catch you guys next time.